It's not us. It's a monster. The bank isn't like a man. The Grapes of Wrath by John Steinbeck is an epic novel published in 1939 that portrays the struggles of the Joad family, a group of Oklahoma farmers during the Great Depression. The novel follows their arduous journey from their dust-ravaged farm and to California in search of a better life. Tom, recently released from prison, embarks on a journey back to his family's farm in Oklahoma. However, upon his arrival, he is met with a bleak reality. The aunt's thriving farm is now barren wasteland, ravaged by the devastating effects of the Dust Bowl a severe drought that has plagued the region. The unforgiving forces of nature, combined with the economic hardships of the Great Depression, have left the Jode family in a state of desperation. To their dismay, the Jodes soon discover that their plight extends far beyond their own misfortune. As they attempt to save their farm from foreclosure, they encounter an unrelenting wall of resistance from powerful banks and corporations. Driven by profit and devoid of compassion, these institutions push the Jodes and countless other families off their land, leaving them without a means of livelihood or a place to call home. Facing eviction and with their hopes shattered, the Jodes make the difficult decision to join the waves of migrant families who are seeking refuge and opportunities in California. Throughout their arduous journey, the Jode family confronts a multitude of challenges that test their resilience and strength. The hardships they face serve as powerful reminders of the harsh realities endured by countless migrant families during the Great Depression. As the Jodes travel westward, they grapple with the constant gnaw of hunger, a relentless companion on their path. Their meager resources dwindle, forcing them to rely on sparse rations and whatever sustenance they can scrounge. Yet. Despite their physical depletion, the Jodes press on, driven by an unyielding determination to secure a better future for themselves and their loved ones. Tragically, the journey exacts an even greater toll on the Jode family. They experience the profound anguish of losing cherished family members along the way. The weight of grief bears heavily upon them, piercing their hearts with sorrow and leaving indelible scars. Yet, Amidst their personal losses, they find solace in the bonds they forge with other migrant families, who, like them, have endured immeasurable suffering and loss. They draw strength from the collective support and empathy that arises from these chance encounters, recognizing that they are not alone in their plight. John Steinbeck presents a searing critique of the social injustices and economic inequalities that define the Great Depression era in the United States. Through his powerful storytelling, Steinbeck exposes the exploitative practices of banks, corporations, and larger landowners who profited at the expense of the working class, particularly migrant workers. Steinbeck vividly depicts the harsh reality of a system that prioritizes profit and wealth accumulation over the well-being of individuals and communities. The novel highlights the plight of the Jode family and countless others who are victims of ruthless exploitation. These individuals are forced into desperate circumstances, leaving their homes and embarking on arduous journeys in search of a better life. By exposing the oppressive practices of banks, corporations, and large landowners, Steinbeck underscores the concentration of wealth and power in the hands of a privileged few. Meanwhile, the working class, represented by the Jodes and other migrants, bear the brunt of economic hardship, poverty, and deprivation. Steinbeck drew inspiration from his time and the historical events of the 1930s as the American agricultural industry was facing significant challenges. One of the major issues was the Dust Bowl, a series of severe dust storms that affected the Great Plains region, including Oklahoma. Many farmers were left without work or the means to support their families. In addition to the environmental crisis, the Great Depression had plunged the country into economic turmoil. The stock market crash of 1929 triggered a widespread collapse of banks, businesses, and the job market. 
unemployment rates skyrocketed, and poverty became rampant. People across the nation, particularly those in rural areas, were struggling to survive and provide for their families. The Grapes of Wrath was met with both critical acclaim and controversy upon its publication. It resonated with readers, shedding light on the struggles of the working class and exposing the harsh realities of the time. The novel remains a significant work of American literature, providing a profound reflection of the historical background and social conditions that shaped the lives of many during the Great Depression era. Buy the book by clicking the link in the description and don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section.